Hi everybody, this is Morgan Bowen from Rocky Mountain Permaculture and RockyMountainPermaculture.com and just giving you a little update today on our uh, uh, greenhouse that we're putting up here. It's our earth integrated greenhouse here in northern Utah and we'll just run through a little quick tour as we're showing you the progress going on. It's Thanksgiving Day so happy Thanksgiving everyone and let me just give you a little rundown of what we're doing here. So first of all there's uh, the back side of the dome that's getting put into place there and what we're building is a it's going to be a dome it's a dome like structure and you can kind of kind of get a little idea of the length of it it's uh and, and and I'll walk you through the process here so what we've done is we've dug down about three feet and then the dome structure is actually resting on a footing that are uh, rubberized railroad ties here that um, that we've got down here at the bottom if you can kind of see that we've got these rubberized railroad ties and uh, the the dome structure fits on top of that we have a very high water table out here so it's that's why we couldn't dig it down as far as we would like to so we're going to put the dirt on each side of the bottom part of the structure and that will give a nice um, thermal wrap of earth uh, to give it a constant temperature and also keep the structure solid from all sides so basically it's, it's cocooned in earth the top part here on the south facing side will be uh, going all along uh, the north facing side over this this way here um, will be will be a wall and the wall will also be bermed up with earth like a berm on the back side of this up to the top of the structure with earth with the glazing across the top here all the way down and then we're going to uh, put along the side walls on the interior some of these QB containers over here if you can see the back of my car I'm bringing a few of these out here these IBC containers we're going to paint those black and we'll put water in those along the edge of the wall here once it's completed. So when the sun hits that, they will uh, they'll they'll radiate heat back into the structure as well. Plus, over the summer, we're going to get some of that annualized thermal inertia that we'll have going along with this, and it will be a uh, a heat banking heat all summer long to radiate out as well through the winter. And if we need some supplemental um, heat. Uh, coming next winter, which we might, it gets very, very cold up here, we may end up putting a uh, rocket mass heater in here as well to uh, keep the heat going and keep the plants going. The idea is we want to have tropicals in here in the winter and to enjoy some tropical trees. And we, we're going to definitely have the height on this building. It's quite a quite a tall tall um, ceiling, high ceiling up there to the to the top of the ceiling there. Once again, cocooned around the entire thing with Earth. Now, as we get the project more and more underway and more things going, we're going to give you more updates to this and show you how we're doing things and how things are going in. But I wanted to kind of get a little bit of an update to those who have sent some teaser pictures out on the on the uh, Rocky Mountain Permaculture Facebook site and also on the on the um, Rocky Mountain Permaculture YouTube channel as well. But as you can tell, it's a it's a fun little project, um, and we're going to talk hopefully on Saturday to uh, Nathan, our builder, who's putting this together for us and, and came up with the design on this and just kind of see where he's at. Hopefully a little more um, progress on this by then. But if you notice, it's just a gorgeous place and, uh, and a beautiful part of the world. Um, and uh, that's, that's the area in which we are. Anyway, happy Thanksgiving, happy holidays and Christmas and all that. We'll give you more updates as we go. And uh, hopefully uh, we'll have a structure here in place uh, in not too many more weeks and we'll get this rolling and next year we'll start putting some plants in here and and we'll just uh, keep you updated on the progress and the project and and um, so uh, keep 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 up with us uh, keep subscribing to my YouTube channel keep uh, letting people know and share this on Facebook um, so people can get involved with us, with us here at Rocky Mountain Permaculture and RockyMountainPermaculture.com thank you all